Why, hello everyone! I'm your lovely host, Innocent, and welcome to today's video. It's another speed paint of the lovely Shane Dawson. <laughs> Before we get started, I just wanted to say to anybody who saw yesterday's video, I'm doing a lot better today. I had about 15 hours of sleep last night, so I'm doing pretty good and I have a bunch of energy. And I've spent all day drawing instead of doing any other rigorous activities, so... That's why I drew Shane Dawson. And yes, I know I had a different YouTuber lined up, but I was watching a lot of conspiracy theory videos and th this just happened, okay? <sighs> Either way, I've been watching Shane Dawson for as long as I've known YouTube to exist, really. I remember his old sketches and I remember watching them and I remember being very confused by them, but still watching them anyway. <laughs> And I do love his newer content a lot more than his older content. He's grown so much as a person, and yes, queen, please. <laughs> Take me to trash heaven. <laughs> um, I know I made a lot of references to Shane Dawson on my channel before, although I don't think they actually um, were ever recognized as Shane Dawson-like things, but... They were in my heart, so that's all that matters. <laughs> and of course, when doing YouTuber chibis, I still want to do some of the OG YouTubers. Especially if they're still around today, like, a lot of them. And the first one to come to mind was Shane because I still watch him to this day. I watch him a lot. <laughs> that's, that's an understatement. I, like, I of course skip over a few videos here and there because they're just not what I want to watch. But other than that, I just... I really like what he puts out, and I really admire his work ethic, and even though he does throw around a lot of money sometimes, which irks me, he does it for a good cause, most of the time. But I'm just really happy that he's happy at this point. <laughs> and just... It's amazing what you can do when you have a business. I've learned so much from him, like, business-savvy-wise, from watching his videos and watching what he's done throughout the years, and even though I might not agree with what he does, it still is eye-opening to see what he does. Does that make any sense? Am I crazy? We already know I'm crazy. <laughs> Let's move on. Um, I don't know if this is going to even translate well other than his shirt that this is Shane, so I do apologize. I tried my best to capture his likeness, but I don't know if it comes off well. With Shane, it's... he uh, When taking out all of the aspects of his facial structure, he looks like any other YouTube guy with same haircut, same facial hair. It, he just kind of looks same-ish, which I hate to say, but... He does, especially when taking out, like, his nose or his, like, eye shape. All of that thing, all of those things that make a person who it is, when you take them down to, like, a cheapified version of them, you lose a lot of what they are. And I want to make sure that if you see a chibi that I produce, you know who it is. So, like, with authenticating them uh, previous-wise, like, um, Commander Holly was very easy to stand out because she had a very specific outfit. Uh, Jacksepticeye had Sam, <laughs> but Shane has his merch, which <laughs> it sounds really bad to say like that, but that was the only identifying feature I could put on him to make you know it was him. Plus, he wears, like, the same outfit in almost every video. I'm not that far behind you. I've been wearing this same shirt for about three months now, oh, so I understand. I understand you, Queen. <laughs> Luckily, there's things called a washer and dryer, so we don't have to worry about it being that bad. <laughs> but, yeah, I really do understand Shane and where he comes from. I've always been the fat kid. I haven't had his glow up. I haven't had a glow, glow up like him yet. I'm still the fat kid. <laughs> Which is why I don't tend to show myself a lot on video or anything, and I tend to use a persona or, like, 3D animated everything, because I just, I don't, I'm not proud of how I look, and I 
understand where Shane's coming from. Like, I'm glad. He, I'm very glad that he was able to overcome some of his insecurities and was able to grow as a person while still actually doing what he wanted and everything. And I just... It makes me proud. It makes me like a proud mom to see him grow up. <laughs> and Well, he didn't grow up, but I've been watching him for so long that he just kind of feels like part of my family. You know how this goes. You've watched other YouTubers before. <laughs> And for me to try and come onto this platform and make my, like, stake in the ground while watching everybody else who's done it before and has succeeded, it, it's kind of daunting in a way. Um, it's very scary, and you definitely don't think you're going to do well, especially when you're starting out. You never think you're going to do well. And it's kind of scary. And I know a lot of, of the big YouTubers have felt that way before, and I know Shane Dawson has definitely come and helped other smaller YouTubers. And I love watching those types of videos from him because it makes me inspired to keep doing what I'm doing. Does that make any sense? <laughs> and I know my art and all my voice acting and all the things that I do on this channel are very far and in between, if that makes any sense. I don't know if I'm even making sense at this point, so I'd, I apologize if I'm not, but still, watching his videos where he collaborates with younger channels, or not younger channels, smaller channels, or younger channels, and he's, he just seems like such a loving and understanding person that I can't help but just be inspired by watching him even though he's so much bigger than I am and he's so much like more successful and all of this everything he just seems so genuine especially for a big youtuber youtuber wow I can talk <laughs> but he's he's just an interesting youtuber to say the least which is why when I finally thought about drawing him I had to do it immediately and I skipped all of the other ones in my list to do it because I don't know if he's ever going to see this. I don't know if he's going to watch this video, even see the, the art that I made, but <laughs> it I, I still show my support some way or another. I can't buy merch and I don't watch ads because I'm skeptical of all ads. <laughs> but I this is the most I can do for YouTubers because AdSense can only do so much. Trust me, I know personally. <laughs> but of course, with any of these chibis that I make, if any YouTuber sees this and wants to use the chibis that I've made for any type of purpose, let me know. DM me on Twitter or something. You can use them. They, they are you. Why wouldn't you be able to use them? <laughs> but yeah, um... I'm just, I really do feel like a proud mom when watching Shane Dawson grow up, or at least grow up on YouTube. So it makes me feel weird because I am definitely younger than him, <laughs> but I've seen him and watched him for so long that I just, it feels like family and I don't know how else to express that. And I know it sounds weird. I really know it does. But when you've been on this platform for so long, watching all of these people grow and expand as creators and individuals, you just kind of feel like they're your family at this point. And for reference, I've had this specific account since 2009, but I've been on this platform since it began, basically. I just never got around to making an account for a long while and the first account I made I can no longer get access to so I've been here for a while <laughs> I'm old <sighs> but yeah I just I don't know what else to say he's a great guy and hell if you somehow don't know who he is or haven't watched one of his videos or one of his newer videos I recommend go doing that Stop this video. Don't even watch to the end of it. Just go and watch one of his videos. His links are in the description as always. Just go and watch him. If you have already watched him, well, thank you. I'll wrap this up here. 
Thank you for watching. I hope you had a wonderful time. I hope you enjoyed the art. And I hope to see you all so very soon. Peace out. Bye-bye.